Hello, my name is Rosario Sanchez Ledesma. I'm a Wisconsin voter. My parents were the first example of people practicing democracy in my life. And my mom was the first to become a US citizen in the early 70s, and then my dad much later in life. And I remember my mother just uh, preparing for the civics test that comes along with becoming a US citizen, and her always underscoring the importance of voting to us. She would say, remember, when you grow up and you have an opportunity to vote, you make sure you vote. It's not just an opportunity, it's your right as a U.S. citizen. And it was very important to her. The experience of voting makes me feel empowered. It makes me feel like I have a voice in helping address some really big problems. So whether it is women's issues, the environment, education, or world peace, I feel that when I go in and I cast a vote, I'm making myself available to participate in a process that is addressing these, these problems and that's creating solutions by way of our public servants and by way of the people who rally, organize, and express their thoughts and opinions about a certain issue. This notion that your vote doesn't matter um, is popular with a lot of the young people in my life. And I've had this conversation with former students, with family members, and I would say that there were people who fought throughout history for the right to vote, to defend the democratic principles and the democratic values of our nation. I say to them, you matter, your vote matters. And it's something that we shouldn't take for granted. The freedom that we have should never be taken for granted. Be a Wisconsin voter. My name is Bob and I'm a Wisconsin voter. I've not voted only one time in my entire life. I was a volunteer during the Vietnam War. I went as a private. In fact, I had deferments and I actually, uh, my eyesight so bad that I had to memorize the eye chart. The joke is I could have brought a seeing eye dog with me, however, and they would have let me in. I was surprised one day when I was out in this remote area and I received my absentee ballot. And there was a note on there that said, I needed a notary public in order to have my vote count. I felt cheated. It was really bad. It was the worst feeling I had ever had over there, even in the combat area. That is how, why our voting is so important and why it's essential for people to get involved in what they're doing. It's not something to let the other guy do it. You're the guy that has to do it. Be a Wisconsin voter. I am Devet Baker and I am a Wisconsin voter. I was born and raised in Milwaukee and we have a little issue down there with voter ID. So I went to vote in the primaries and the ladies told me I couldn't vote because my ID did not match the address they had in the book. Now we all know, I know the rules. So I said, okay, I'm not leaving here until I get my ballot and I plopped it down on the floor. The commissioner who I knew came over and he said, Devet, could you get off the floor, please? And I said, well, they're telling me I can't vote, so I'm just gonna sit here until the election commission gets here. And I was getting ready to call them and then he explained to the ladies that were working that I could vote, that the name just needed to match what was in the book. And then I got my ballot. I think I was voter 77. So my mom has always been a teacher and so we always usually voted at where she taught. So I have never, my parents have never missed an election um, unless someone wasn't feeling well. Um, my mom will say, people died so we could vote. So you vote. Be a Wisconsin voter. I am Jonathan Suniga and I am a Wisconsin voter. So it is very important to vote, um, especially in local elections, because uh, those offices directly impact our lives, our community, our neighborhoods. To the people who say that voting is a waste of time, I would say that I understand their frustration. Um, there has been many times that they have um, listened to elected officials break their promises or expect a change in their neighborhood, and that change never comes to their neighborhood. Uh, but I would tell them that we cannot give up. 
um, elected officials make decisions that impact our lives in our neighborhoods. Um, our safety, our parks, our schools, um, our programs that we value, um, they are making uh, key decisions about those things uh, that we care about. Um, so we can't simply just give up. Voting is only part, um, or it's only the first step to making a difference in our communities. Be a Wisconsin voter. Sea un votante en Wisconsin, su voto es su poder.